Hello and welcome to the course on Docker Basics. This video we will see about bind mount, so which is used for sharing data between the container and host. As a first step, so we will go ahead and download nginx image. So this will be downloading the image from the Docker Hub repository which is hosted in internet. So this takes some time based on your internet bandwidth. So we are going to run a docker container using this nginx image so for that we use docker run command and uh, so okay before that first we will create a directory so which is used to mount with this container so that is slash tmp nginx slash html so this is the directory that we are going to create and then we use docker run to run the container iphone t iphone d for detachable p for mapping the port iphone v option we use to uh, mount this directory with the container so slash user share nginx html directory of the container is mounted with slash tmp nginx html of the host and we will give the container name and image name now you just check uh, docker container ls you can see the container is up and running so next we will uh, check this host machine ip address uh, you can use if config command and this is my ip address and i will get let me get the port number which is used uh, running the container and uh, note down the ip address and here you can see the host machine 32769 of the port so open the browser use http this ip colon port so http colon ip then port go ahead and press enter so you cannot see any page because index.html is missing from that directory inside the container i have a copy of this index.html so this is just a, a sample html file i've uh, edited and contents are here and what i'm going to do here is uh, okay let me find out the directory which i mounted it's a slash tmp nginx html so uh, Okay, uh, let me check is there any contents available inside that directory. Nothing is there. So I am going to copy my index.html to this directory. cp index.html slash tmp nginx html. So now we will go back to the browser. Okay, I have copied this file to this directory which is mounted to slash user share nginx html. And from the browser, go ahead and refresh. Now we can see the page. So this is from the index.html which I copied to slash tmp nginx html. And you can see the file is available under slash tmp nginx html. So we will go inside that directory and uh, make some changes to this index.html file. And here I am just changing the message welcome nginx to welcome nginx edited. Okay, edited message. So go ahead and save this. Now back to the browser, refresh the page. We can see that new message is printing here. So this way we can share the content uh, between the container and host. And uh, take the container ID and use docker inspect. Okay, and that container ID. Scroll up and uh, somewhere you can see this volume information just under mount you can see type is bind and uh, source and destination source is the directory from the host and destination is the directory inside the container i hope this is very clear and with that i am concluding this demonstration we'll see in the next video thank you for watching bye